Welcome back to another LDG Plays. Brian here. I am joined by Frank. You can't see him, but he's there. Say hello. Hey, guys. As you can see, we are about to take a dive into a game known as TikTok, A Tale for Two. Shout out to our friends over at Other Tales Interactive. They did provide us with several keys to this game. Uh, we're utilizing two of them right now so that Frank and I can play through this for this video. And you can catch another, hopefully another of a gameplay video of it, uh, twitch.tv slash Bruce Deduce. That's where uh, another staff member here at Level Down Games, Kyle, will be streaming TikTok, A Tale for Two, on Twitch either later today or tomorrow. Just follow him over there, twitch.tv slash Bruce Deduce. You can also find that on our website, leveldowngames.com. So that way you're notified when he goes live and uh, hopefully you'll catch a stream of doing this as well. So what is TikTok, A Tale for Two? Well, it's a cooperative multiplayer game. That's all we know, really. I mean, we didn't really look into this that much and the game officially releases today. So again, shout out to the team for providing us early access so we can do Thank this. You. And yeah, I think we should just jump in, man. Here we go. Let's get it. All this right. is a two player adventure. Going solo is not an option. Pick a different player each and communicate to solve puzzles either in person or through phone call online chat. The game itself doesn't require an internet connection. Oh, what? That's weird. For the best experience, don't look at each other's screen. Oh, dude, we don't even uh -huh. have to be. We're not even linked up. Is that is that huh. right? For the best experience, don't look at each other's screens. But if you get stuck and need a hint, then it doesn't hurt to take a peek. No, we're not. No, yeah. well, we're well, clear. You're clearly at another state. You can click, drag, spin, and use the well, mouse well, to explore the, the world. Screen share and stuff. Sure, we're not sure. Doing. If you're calling through an online, I recommend Discord. Which we are using. Okay, so a two-player co-op game played on two devices. Choose player, player one, or player two. Which one do you want? Player one or player two? I'll be player two. All right, I'll click player one. You are player one. Make sure your team member is player two. Start. Dude, that is, so this is, okay, I think we should stop here for a second. So this is a game, you know, we've played games like uh, We Were Here, We Were Here To, A Way Out. You know, we, we generally like to jump into these co-op games and play them together because it makes for good content and they're fun games. And they're, you know, we both like puzzle games. This is a game that doesn't require an online connection. So now I'm getting why they're saying you can't play it alone because you have to have somebody else literally start playing as the second player at the same time you're playing player one or player two. That's okay, kind of so crazy. It's different. Weird, I, I, I'm down because uh, you said you literally could play uh, with the cell phone and talk to each other. Okay, that's what they made. Or you could just right. literally play by yourself on the cell phone and the computer. <laughs> I all right, so you ready? Let's start playing. Yeah, so it says you are player one, so it should say you are player two. Start playing. Ooh, a little, little curfew bell. <laughs> Today, you and your friend received two strange packages. Each contained an old clock. You received a package from someone called Amelie Robin, and your friend got one, too. Yours is loading a lot faster than mine if it says that. Oh, I'm already on the screen. Okay, so what I see here, Saturday, a clock that says Saturday, March 2nd, 2019, which it is. I have I have that. I have, I'm on the <laughs> table. And which is super crazy piece. that it's the correct date. Like that, that's clearly uh, pulling from your PC. I have, I have I have a piece of paper here that says Dear Player 2. I have one that says Dear Player 1. Uh, mine uh, says- well, I'll, let you, I'll let you read yours first and I'll read you mine. All right, Dear Player 1, this clock is part of a game, a gift I made for my sister to have a fighting chance, play with a friend and tell each other what you read and see. If you find my sister, tell her I miss her, Amelie. That's all mine says. Dear Dear player two, I sent one clock to you and one to your friend. If you want to play a game, look into the past together. Remember to wind the clocks up. Amelie. Okay. So I have a paper clip. A paper clip and I have a losing a eraser on the end of the thing. I, oh, the paper clip is interactable, I think. Yeah. Uh, I click on it and it just moves. How do I? I, I, I click it and it doesn't want to do anything. Yeah, same. Yeah. Uh, the, I have like an eraser. Try, oh, okay. So the mouse wheel. I'm trying. I was trying to figure out the controls. Mouse wheel looks up and down, like around the screen and stuff. So. Okay. So yeah, I got a. So I have a box. I have a. I have a box. Which about? What's what's what's? Is there a seal on your box? Uh, yeah. It says Denmark. Is yours Mine's also from Denmark. One zero nine seven six five eight nine zero. Okay, we have the same box. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> in, inside the box is a newspaper clipping. It says another another disappearance. S T R I, uh, by Mark D Hansen. Uh. The youngest member of the renowned clockmaker family, Lark, was reported missing yesterday. Her sister, Emily, told us she had last seen her at 1030. Is the, the title of your thing kind of like cut off? Yes. Looks like you might have well, the second half. 
I have, I have the other half. What's, what's, yours, what's, what's the title of yours? Another Disappearance STRI. Strikes our village. Completes okay. the sentence. Uh, so the other half of that is understandably distressed. She later corrected her statement and said it must have been an hour and a half later. Contact if you have heard anything unusual. Please contact police. An hour and a half later. My time is at 1030. So an hour and a half later would be midnight or noon, whatever it is. So. I, I do have a little uh, pocket watch over here. As do I. It says Emily uh, 1915. Now, mine is Lark, which is L, the A E letter together. Yeah. R K E 1917 1937. Okay, so mine is literally just Emily 1915 blank. Uh, and I'm actually winding up my clock. Uh, I'm going to set it to midnight then. That's what I'm trying to do here. I set it to midnight or 12 and uh, didn't do it. oh, make sure you click the top button afterwards and it does something. Ooh. Chapter one. This is a copy I made of the world that Larrick and I used to know. Does your say, does your say Emily and I or does it say something different? Different. Mine says chapter one. Larrick went missing in 1937. Oh, wow. But it all started, but it all started years before. Uh, game just rewound to 1927. 2019 going back to probably, you know, probably 1927, 27. Yeah. Uh, looks like we are at a old style looking train stop. And I'm looking at a clock, like an old style clock that says midnight. Uh, looks like there's a hill with some train tracks in the background. Yes, uh, I'm at a bus stop. Yeah, I'm at that same bus stop. Um, oh, and there's, there's a house behind there. us. Like, if you actually spin your camera around, there's a house behind us. There, Raven, I have Raven's clocks behind me. I just have an actual house. It doesn't say what it is. Uh, and then there's also... Oh, 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 oh there, there's, a, there's a house behind okay, me. Okay, no, I, 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 found, I found Raven's clocks. Never mind. And there's also a well. Okay. Um, you want to proceed? With, uh, we're going to the thing right in front of us. Uh, yeah, let's, the bus check, stop, there's let's a... check the bus stop first. So I'm, I'm at the terminal. I have a, 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 a terminal. It's a grid. It's one, two, three, four, five, six by one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, six by eight. Uh, and I have a train in the bottom left corner. Bottom, bottom left. Same. Uh, is your right button missing? My right button is missing. OK, so the same as mine. Uh, looks like if we click the, the actual controls, it does move this train around. Uh, all I can do is move it up. I can't move it any other direction. So. Kick. There's no down. I get reset to bring it back. Yeah, so all I can do is move up and I can't go left or down. So reset goes okay. back. So we can't start here. Um, and There's it is, it is, it is no longer it. midnight. It is now 11. <laughs> so the time is working backwards. <laughs> huh. wonder if that that's clearly going to mean something. Uh, the street lights are not interactable. You can't progress up this hill. So where should we go? Want to go to the clock shop? All right, let's check oh, out the clock. Oh, I, I, spun, I spun back around and it's midnight again. Uh, the clock store is closed. The opening hours, it says from three to nine, so we cannot get in. I'm looking, I'm clicking everything to see if there's anything different. You can click that gear next to the clock shop, but it doesn't actually do anything. Um, the bushes vibrate, but they don't do anything. Top window, just everything on the house just brings up that open three to nine, so yeah, we can't start there. there. Uh, I'm going to, okay, these lamps are clickable, but they don't do anything. I'm going to check out the well. Can I get to the well? Yeah, I can get to the well. Oh, the uh -huh. well leads down a ladder. And oh, no, I'm going with you. Oh, we're going together. That's fine. You have to literally click and, and move yourself down the ladder. No actual. Yeah, the keyboard doesn't okay, do anything okay, in this okay, game. Okay, okay, okay. At the bottom, I have a puzzle, uh, seems like. <laughs> what is yeah. lit up for you and what is a circle or square for you? What's a square? What's a circle? Squares, I have a uh, black triangle at the top left corner. Okay, yours is totally but, different than mine then. Okay. Um, I have so three. The, the, so, which, 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 from, 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 so, I'm going from top to bottom. I'm going to go left to right, top to bottom for what I have for you. Yeah. So, square. It's going to be a, in, in the thing, it's going to be a white triangle on a stick. Everything's on a stick. Everything is definitely on a stick. Okay, so. Solid black triangle, solid black square. That one has a circle under it. Hey, I'm writing this down. So solid black triangle, solid black square, solid black square. Oh, uh, white uh, triangle, white triangle. 
And then underneath. And underneath. Bo- so, but the bottom left is white triangle, white square, white square. Uh, things that have um, squares under them, it's, it's going to be uh, my top left, bottom middle, top right. Top, the other ones are circles. Top left, bottom right? No, bottom, bottom middle, top right. Okay. So. And then the others are circles. So. Okay, so mine, uh, top, top left is a white circle. Okay. Middle is a white circle. Top right is a dark circle, a black circle. And again, everything's on a stick. Uh, Bottom left is a white square. Bottom middle is a white triangle. Bottom right is a black circle. The ones that have circles underneath them, uh, the same as yours that have circles. Uh, Because you you, no, the same as yours that have squares. So bottom, I'm sorry, top left, bottom middle, top right have circles underneath them. Uh, The other three, bottom left, top middle, and bottom right have squares. So it's the opposite of yours. All right, so we got to figure this out because there's a little, like, switch on the right-hand side of it. Right, and and touching that does nothing as of right now. Uh, Okay, so um, by hitting the the, the circle buttons... It changes things. It it changes things. So I think we have to match what the other person has in those three because the other three are not interactable, if you notice. Oh, wait. I'm able to get your white circle. I think you have to do your three that you can do to mine, and I have to do mine to yours. Let's try that. So you have top left is a dark triangle, bottom middle is a white square, and top right is a white triangle. Okay, I have mine as what yours should be. That opened it. That opened it. So I just had to get those three to what you have. It didn't work, right? So... Why? This is oh, it's a white square on the bottom. Sorry, that's that's why it didn't work. Should be a white triangle. Um, I got black. The, it's it's the right button. Yeah, it's the right button. Yep. Okay. We did it. We're so smart. Easy enough. Oh, and it puts it like down there in the bottom right hand corner of the screen, so you can see. Uh, I can actually reclose the box now. That's kind of cool. And is there anything else down here? Like, oops, I actually closed mm-hmm. out of the game. I didn't close I, out I of didn't the game. I didn't see anything else. All right, so we had to go back up. Now we we just literally just drag ourselves back up the ladder. Uh, should we check out the house before we interact with the terminal again? Yeah, let's, let's, let's do that. All right, let's see what's over here. Making Ooh, we can actually get to the house. Making our way downtown. Is that what you're going to sing? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that? A, Vanessa Carlton? Uh, is that? Yes, it is. <laughs> why do I know that? I, I am not going to say why you know that. Uh, so I have a jack-in-the-box sitting here. I have a train and a, and a light, like a, a, a bulb that's not turned on. I'm spinning with the jack-in-the-box not doing anything. I'm spinning my train. Oh, 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 okay. So spinning the actual wheel of the train makes words come out of the top. Oh, I can actually make, okay, it says, okay, so it's a, it's, it's not in order. It says, I, you, your turn anti-clockwise times twice, twice, keep it, oh, do let. (laughs) Hold on, hold on. Anti-clockwise two times. Anti-clockwise Times twice is what it says. Turn anti-clockwise times twice. Oh, I know. If I turn on the light, it actually it actually finishes the uh, finishes the, the sentence. So it says, Larry, I, I, I hope you like your present. Turn it anti-clockwise three times. One, Let me know. One, two, three. Clockwise twice. One, two. Anti-clockwise twice. Now keep turning it clockwise and do not let go. Okay, I was I, I to probably start from the beginning because. Oh, it okay. might have messed up when when I when you started doing it before, like the first time, before I I'm had the whole sentence. Up. I'm gonna go back up to it and go right back into it. Okay. Yeah, 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 that works. All right, so anti-clockwise three times. Turn it anti-clockwise three times. One. Two. Three. Clockwise twice. One. Two. Anti-clockwise twice. One. Two. Then keep turning it clockwise and do not let go. Jesus Christ, I popped that was scared hell of me. <laughs> Damn, I wish I had that on camera. 
All right, so I have a por portion of the uh, ticket that shows you how to get up, uh, how to get around. So. Um, okay, so I think that's all we need because I can't move around in this house anymore. So, is it a ticket like for that terminal outside? Yeah. Okay, so My we gotta go back out there. Zero 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 six seven. You're um, the only one that has a ticket, so. Hold on, so. Oh, it's, it's only half of a ticket. Ooh, where's my ticket then? Up. I'm going back in the house to look then. I did, maybe I missed something in there. Oh, I think this is one. Bear with me here. I have to draw this out for myself. That's fine. I'm interacting with everything I can to see if I can find something in this house, like a ticket. Okay, so once we get over to four. No, I literally can't interact with anything okay. else in this house, so I, I do not have I a half have, a ticket oh. right now. Okay, so, um... I can't even interact with the light anymore, so... Yeah. There's nothing else for me to interact here in this house. Yeah, same. Like, I only have the one thing, so... Uh, I wonder if I can spin the ticket around, or...? I'm gonna I back can't. out no. and look around the outside of the house, and... I'm not seeing anything out here, either. That's a maybe, uh, maybe, maybe your half is somewhere... Uh, maybe your half is in the, the clock shop. Ooh, maybe. So, oh, wait, how do... So how do we get to... How do we get it to be? How do we get it to be the time the, the clock shop is open? What did we do? So now my time says ten o'clock. Or yeah, now it says nine. No, my and the clock shop is open. No, keep spinning. Keep spinning. Your keep going around in, in in one particular order till you can get in the clock shop. Like keep rotating your camera around in a circle. And if, okay, uh, yeah. one more one more time, and then you should be able to enter the clock shop. And now the clock shop should be open. 3 p.m. Okay, gotcha. Um, okay, okay, I have, I have, I, I'm only looking at one screen here. Uh, oh, I found a tube of some sort. Okay, and I have a old-fashioned radio with. Uh, yeah, as as do I. Uh, I have a radio down there, and if I drag my camera up, I see a clock. I see two more clocks, a actual okay, cuckoo I, clock. I, but I, what I do is I, I change the uh, the station. setting on it, like station, and I have a fragmented sentence. So my, mine is the ha second half of your sentence. So I'm assuming you have to figure yours out. Uh, my my sentence is complete. Uh, if I if I turn it to 80, uh, 820 hertz, it says the oldest raven daughter or the oldest raven daughter Amelie is a brilliant clockmaker and inventor. Her footsteps. And that's all it says. Her footsteps, and then it stops. Are usually followed by the ticking and scuttling of one of her creations, and when that happened, a little uh, like roach mate toy came to me. Let's go more. There's more sentences that we should figure out here. Yeah. So at, at 115 hertz, I have. Let's start, 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 start at the top. 52.5. A little to the right of that. There's something. 52.5. A little to the right of that. Oh, like I didn't. I, I, I skipped over that. Okay. Last month, the police started getting several reports of pets going missing, mostly old cats and dogs. Let's hope they are found soon. Okay. We rated 820 hertz. Yeah, but let's read it again. So now we're getting it in order. The oldest, ra the oldest raven daughter, Amelie, is a brilliant clockmaker and inventor. Her footsteps. Oh, sorry. Are usually followed by the ticking and scuttling of one of her creations. Something around, there's something around uh, there's something in the middle of, yeah like 900 ish the Raven family moved here a month ago and have worked day and night to be able to open their clock shop the 18th the 18th okay I'm gonna write that down the 18th we might need that um where are we going now 11:15 ish yeah a little to the right of that, yeah another pet has been stolen during the night this time it was Mrs Jensen's Sweet old farm dog, remember to lock your doors until the thief has been caught. Hey. Okay. Uh, to, to the yeah. To, well, no, actually, about thirteen seventy ish. Yeah. Like, okay. That's okay. Right. A strange occurrence has shook our village. Droves of lifeless birds have been found scattered across the forest floor. That's not good. Well, that's maybe a plague. <laughs> um. 
1500 ish yeah roughly yeah no more walking for five miles to get your letters it's now march and the construction of our very own post office will start at the end of the month okay and then the last one is right at 17 oh, right before 1705 it looks like mm -hmm. uh an unusual white raven seems attached to the youngest member of the raven family let's hope for her sake that it will not go missing like those other pets all right, and that's everything. That's all, that's all I can do in here. I've turned my radio off. Um, now scroll your camera up. Like I said, there's stuff above it. So I have a clock that's stuck at like 8:44. Write that down. Uh, my, mine is stuck at 4:44. Uh, so yours is 4:44. Mine's at 8:44. And I cannot move that clock. I can't like actually. They're both. They're both actually, I have two clocks uh, stuck at that time. Uh, as do I. There's one to the right. Uh, actually, I have four clocks stuck at that time. <laughs> four, clock, four clocks at that time. Yeah. No. Um, um, looks like the cuckoo clock doesn't do anything. No, nope, I can't make it come out. But like I said, I do have a pipe above that on like a what looks like, like a ledge or something. Do you have that? I have two white feathers. I have a like a it's like a literally like a like a white pipe of some sort, and then above that, I have a calendar. I have a uh, a news it says Wednesday's edition. What's the date? Because my calendar it says uh, Sunday, January first, nineteen twenty seven, and I can select any date, uh, and any month, and any day. <laughs> uh, it's, a, it's it's this is the very top of the thing. So to the right of that, there's a uh, the, the window to look out. It says news Wednesday edition in Raven's clock shop. You can buy all kinds of clockwork request commissions and get your old clock repaired today. Grand opening of clock shop. The world renowned clock maker, Mr. Raven has opened a new clock shop in our town. He said to, to be an interesting care and that's cut off probably character. The level of detail is exquisite. Our own queen is said to have a couple of his elegant pieces today. He is opening his. So it's like a part of a. OK, so I have to figure out a date here. Uh, the only thing that I wrote down that we were talking about is the 18th, which was the day the clock shop opened. Um, you said Wednesday was the newspaper, and that's the day that it was. And then I think March was the month. Yep, that works. Wait, Our, you have a calendar that does it? Because I have nothing. That I yeah, I, I literally it. have a calendar in here that, that I've just interacted with to do that. So okay. I have opened in this calendar, and there's my half of the train ticket. <laughs> okay. So yours starts uh, at the bottom. Start starting at the bottom. Um, yeah, bottom middle. Yeah, uh, so you you, sh you should have you should have four columns on yours, and I have four columns on mine. I have the f I, yeah. So I have the first four. Uh, I'm I'm literally drawing this column. Hang on. One, two, three, three, four, five, six. Two, three, four, five, and six, oh. and then. Two, three, and four. Sorry, you can't see what we're doing here on the actual video. I apologize. Just, uh, just know we are sketching out our train ticket. Uh, so now I'm going to add yours. So we got one, two, three, and four. So where does yours start? Uh, mine starts at the very bottom left. So I got um, fr from, from mine. Well, let's so just go back. Let's go. Let's go. I'll, I'll do my part first with you, and then you just tell me what to do on yours. Yeah, I, and I'm just gonna put an X in the in the in the squares we should be traveling. So it starts bottom left because we know that's where the train is. And it goes. So from there you go up, 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 up. Right, right, right. Right, right, right. Down, down. Down, down. Now you're gonna go right, right because that's where mine starts. Yes. Uh, mine starts in that in that one you just said. So now you're gonna go up, up, up. Oh, so up three. Oh. Up. Right two. Right. Right. Up one. Up. Right one. Right. Okay. Let's get our cell uh, I, I Actually, hang on. I have other stuff in this thing, though. I have uh, a book of Gulliver's Travels, a book of watchmaking, uh, a hmm. uh, an empty bottle that I can click but it doesn't do anything, a, another th uh, several things I can click that don't do anything, actually, uh, a scalpel. A pick, a old school compass. I can't. I'm trying everything. And yeah, I have a book that says longitude, a book that says the nightingale. I can't take any of it. And that's Is any, any of it interactable? I, I can click on everything, but it doesn't actually do anything. And it, it makes okay. noise and it shows that I'm clicking on it. 
but I can't do anything with it. Uh, and also my train ticket isn't coming with me. Yours came with you? No. no. Oh, you That's wrote yours down. down. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> And I can't even do anything with this pipe, so I think that's it for this house. Okay. So, uh, so now we're back at the train station. Okay, so I'm gonna put my button there. Where yeah, belongs. and then we just click it to put it in. Yep. Okay, so... Uh, so we go up, 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 right, 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 down, down, right, up, 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 Right, right, up, right. That worked. Yep. I got a little ching ching sound. Yeah, and I don't know what it's doing. What is it? What are we doing here? No, okay, so nothing happened in here. Uh, oh, there's a train here now on the top of the hill. <laughs> there you go. And we just click the train and we're moving on. Chapter two. We did it. It was getting harder to find animals for my experiments, but I still knew one I could get access to easily, is what mine says. I told Lyric I was making her a clock, but she wasn't interested. She was too busy playing with her stupid bird. <laughs> Me and my birds. 1932. Here's my map I drew if you want to see it. Oh, you can't see it. On the oh, there it is. No, you can totally see it on the camera. There it is. <laughs> right there. It's my little train ticket I drew. Uh, uh, no, no, it shows me it says a touch of closed track and actually has the map drawn out. On yeah, it. <laughs> so so we're at, um, it said 1932 because I actually was showing yes. the map to the camera. Okay, so we're at 1932. Let me write that down because we need it. 1932. Uh, it looks like the same way. So spinning our, oh, it's raining and it's thundering outside. Um, the camera spinning around adjusts the time of day. Yeah, it totally does. Oh, Different spot here. Out of the game. So we still have Raven's clock on the left, but behind us we have what like, looks to be an instrument shop. Yes, uh, like a horn. Yeah, should we start there? That's where I want to go, yeah. Yeah, let's go to the instrument shop. It's open right now for me. Oh, okay. It's the post office. That oh, it's the, the post office. Oh, damn. Do we remember the information? Oh, no, I can't, I can't imagine it would be anything similar because it was like five years later. So uh, I have a little uh, bug on mine. Do you have a bug? No. I'm going to click this button and see what it does. Although, it's a wind-up toy. That wind-up toy is what I told you I saw when I uh, was doing the... Uh, yeah, thing, it, the it, just, it just crawled off my screen. I clicked it and it crawled off my screen. Um, I, I'm, in front of a, I'm in front of a red post office box. It says Post Brevkasi. B-R-E-V-K-A-S-S-E. -S -S okay. I'm in front of actual post boxes. Uh, I see one, three, six, nine, twelve post boxes. Uh, labeled 14, 16, 18, 24, 26, 28, 34, 36, 38, 44, 46, 48. I have no, I have no, I have nothing I can, well, I, I'm in front of a post office box. It says post, but if Kasi is like a big red one in the middle, it's, it takes up most of my screen. It's, 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 it's kind of like where you would drop off mail. Like yeah, mail. yeah, yeah. Oh, I can. Um, there's a map on the wall, but it's obscured by some stuff. Uh, nothing interactable. A bunch of pieces of paper to like wrap up packages. Uh, and that's all there is. I, like, there's nothing really for me to do in here, so we probably have to come here. I after. have a lot of stuff to interact with. I have like each post box has four elements I can move around, and like there's one, two, three, four, eight points on a grid I can put four different things to. So imagine circles with points at north, south, east, and west. But there's also like a compass rose, and there's also northeast, southeast, southwest, south, uh, northeast. Or did I say northeast? Hmm. Northeast, southeast, southwest, northwest. And it's like a compass rose where I can actually move these things around to different points. And I have these those nine post or those twelve post boxes, as I said, and I can literally interact with every single one of them, but I can't open any of them. And I'm assuming I can if I have the right patterns to put. Yeah, so so we'll have to probably pick that up at another yeah, spot. So we need to find that somewhere me. else. So should we go to the house? Um Yeah, let's do the house. Alright, let's do the house. So the house is totally different. Yeah, uh, this is different for me. I have I have bells. I'm in front of a fireplace. Room. I'm in front of a fireplace. Like the study? Yeah, I'm in the study. Okay, I'm gonna ring the bell for the study. Nothing happened because we're not connected. <laughs> um, uh, could you go to the next room? I can open the door and it leads to some stairs. I have wood next to a fireplace that is lit. I have an antler above the fireplace. Oh, I can scroll my camera down. Let's see what's down here. Can you scroll down? Um, Going down leads me into no. the basement. Oh, I just, that's how I get down. Like, 
Like I can see that these okay. stairs lead down into the basement. So in so, the basement. So, so Okay, because what I, what I have is I, I, I'm in front of a, a door mm -hmm. and I have one, two, three, four, five, I have six rooms on here, uh, each with a bell above them. And I could ring the bell for each one of the rooms. So I'm assuming I want to hit it for the order of rooms you're in as you're going through. So uh, hang on. I found a I found a sentence that's that's coming out of a barrel. Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> There's a piece of paper. I found a piece of paper under uh, a thing. I left you something downstairs. It will be my greatest invention yet. Play our secret melody and I'll open the door. Oh my God, what's the secret melody? I left you something downstairs. Oh, hang on, I found, another, I found another sentence. Yeah, I'm, I'm literally, I'm finding sentences as we as we talk. I'm, I'm interacting with things in the basement. I interacted with like a barrel and poured a sentence out. Uh, I'm trying to get all the sentences so I can read them in order. Uh, I found a lizard that pulled out another sentence. Uh, there's some barrels here. Oh, what's this? Maybe this does something. There's a rope here. Oh, yep, the rope is another sentence. Um. Oh, and it just made a, it made a, it's making a paragraph. Hang on. Okay. I think I'm actually getting the sentence here, the full sentence. So yeah, I can't see anything else I can interact with. So it says, I've been working on this iteration for one year now in the study. I'd like you to keep it safe from me, Lerk. Look after it really well, like you did with the two kittens you found in the pantry. In five years, when I've gained more knowledge, I'll come back and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. Okay. So, so study, 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 pantry, pantry so the, kitchen, we'll ki we'll we'll kitchen, and then dinner table. Is there a dining room? Dine, dining room. Those are the three. Those are the three rooms in my sentence or my paragraph. That didn't work for me. Uh, did you do study first, then kitchen, then d dining room? Study, kitchen, dining hall is what I did. So. I wonder if there's another sentence somewhere. Didn't work. Try read it to me again. I've been working on this iteration for one year now in the study. I'd like you to keep it safe for me, Lerk. Look after it really well, like you did with the two kittens you found in the pantry. In five years, on. when I'm gonna try, two, I'm gonna try two for the pantry. So one for study, two for pantry. In yeah. five years, I'll come back for you, and I'll be sitting at the dining room table. Try five for so the dining go, room. So I'm gonna go one, two, two. Yep. Okay. Okay. Cool. What did that do? It opened up a door. To the basement, uh, I, I, I can see a light. Yeah. Uh, which now lets me uh, go to, now, now as we scroll down, there's a barrel. Start interacting with everything. So I pulled a sentence out of the barrel. I moved some jugs around or jars and I got another sentence and I interacted with a rope and got another sentence. There's a rope. I can, okay, there's like pots on a, on a yep. shelf that I could be yep. kind of I have, around. Yep. Know. There's pots. There's a couple of, jar there's a couple of jars. There's yep. a crack in the wall. Yep. <laughs> We're in the same room now. Uh, I'm cracking. I'm just going to break this barrel. I found I found a wash by just constantly clicking the barrel. Okay. Yeah. So I had a cork in my barrel that I just had to pull out. So yours was breakable. I Yeah. So I have a wash that is wind. Is it windable? No. Oh, it's showing me a sequence I have to write down. Ah, okay. Maybe what, write that down. Okay. I gotta restart this bad boy because it is intense. Okay. <laughs> yeah, hold on. Hold on. Oh, what are, what are these down? Is it read out to you? Huh? I'm gonna click it and I want you to read out. I'm gonna read out to you. So here. Okay. Yeah. See if it means anything to me right now, and I'll, I'll write the things down as well. Noon. Noon. Twelve fifteen. Twelve thirty. Spin around twice back to noon. Then 12.15 back to 12. So, wow. Spin so, back to noon. 12. Oh, I'm sorry. So it's 12. I'm, I'm, I'm going to start back on Wednesday. So it's yeah. 12. 12. 12.15. 12. 12.15. 12. 12.30. Spin around to 12. Hmm. I can't take this thing with me. That's why I have to. Yeah, 12, no, you, you have to solve it 12. now. That's all you do down here. So obviously the thing I had to find was the watch that sequence, which, 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 which I wrote the sequence down. How many see how many things are there? Are there 12? 12 what? Are there 12 sequences? Sequences one, two, three, four. Remember, I have 12 post boxes with something I can move around as a grid, like a compass rose. 
five, six, seven, eight, nine. You sure there's you though. sure there's not twelve? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, maybe this. Make sure you have the correct order, because that's what I'm gonna need. To okay, get so to I'm open those the... post boxes. You got it? You got the order? Yes, yeah. Alright, now let's go leave this room or leave this house. Do you want to check out the clock shot or real quick before we do the post boxes? Yeah, let's do that. Uh, hang on, I gotta make sh I gotta make it so that the clock shop is open. Ditto. Is it still three to nine? I should check. Uh, yeah, yeah. it is. Okay. Sorry for those that get dizzy by spinning cameras. All right, clock shop's open. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, I am in a totally different area of the clock shop that I can't even move the camera Ditto. in. Uh, I, I have a key, I have a key to the clock shop. Okay. It says clock shop on it. <laughs> now, the item is in my my inventory. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, I am in front of a white bird, possibly a white raven, as we talked about in the previous segment in chapter one. Uh, I have a chest with two drawers to my left that don't open. Uh, creating uh, automatons is a book. Extracting time is a book. I can't interact with those. I have a letter. It says apprenticeship. Dear Amelie, I am pleased to inform you that you have been chosen as my new apprentice. Your experiments with time extractions are truly groundbreaking. I agree that our short lifespan is deeply unfair, especially for people like us who keep improving the world, pushing it forward. I am looking forward to helping you with your experiment in Switzerland. Yours sincerely, Clarissa Schar, Master Watchmaker. And it has a, a C uh, seal. Okay, um, so I, I have a lantern in front of me with a letter that I picked up. So I have the I have a letter and a key both in my possession. Inside this letter, being that it's held up to the light, I can see there's a second key inside. So I have, apparently have two keys. I have a box that says uh, Lark on it. Uh, I want to open. So wait, I, I can't I can't do anything with it though. Okay. I have, I have a picture, uh, which is probably Amelie with her white raven uh, facing the, uh, away from me. So she's so I see it's like the back of her head with a bow, raven on her left shoulder. I have a clock that stopped at 4.45ish. Um, it's a, pl a, pl a potted plant. Nothing else I can interact with, but I do have the key and the letter now. So okay. that's what I got out of this place. I, I, besides my white raven, I have a tool that, uh, you know, looks like you'd be making for watches, but I can't interact with it. I have a, another like scalpel type thing I can't interact with. Um, potentially something that you would put in your eye to like help zoom in back in the day. I have one of those, but I can't interact with it. I have a letter that says, do not remove these tools. I will work when the clock shop is closed. Uh, and then I have uh, three three beads or three like marbles. One is gray or brown. One is white and one is red. Oh, I'm I sure that's a really important. Yeah. Uh, but that's all. Red. Yeah, green. Uh, that's, 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 all, that's all I have in there. I'm writing it down. Brown, white, red. I might need those later. Um, uh, yeah, that's, that's, that's it for now. But now I got to go to the post office. Okay. Which doesn't make sense that the post office literally has a, a instrument shop above its door. Um, oh, so oh, I, I just mailed the letter to Amelie Raven. So now it actually gave me. It okay. says post box. Is, oh wait, it says post box number twenty eight. Um, I have a twenty eight. Is northwest, west. Hang on. Southwest. Northwest, east. west, southwest. East. That opened it. This is how, this is how you're getting your key because I already have mine. So this I, is I just how I'm getting this. Yes, you did. I have a letter that says Amelie Raven, and uh, it's from Lerk, and I have a key. <laughs> and it says, "Here's your key to the clock shop, Amelie. When you're done working, could you help me look for my Raven?" I think we have to go to the clock shop while it's closed. We do. Um, should we try opening some of these other things? Though? I can't. I can't. Uh, all, I, all I had was the ability to mail you that letter. Right. But what I'm asking is, what was the first time that you had in that stopwatch? Noon. So noon exactly. Oh, I'm going. I'm sorry. I, I, I clicked the, the clock shops. I have different things there. No, I know. But I, I was trying to mess around with the because uh, you said you wrote them down. Uh, I was trying yeah, to mess was, around it, with the compass rose to see if I could open any of these other post boxes. It was noon. 12.15, noon, noon, noon. Hang on. 
12. Noon. 12.15. Noon. 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 12.15 again. Okay. 12.30. Okay. Two full, two full rotations around, stopping at noon. Okay. Uh, 12.15. Noon. Okay. Noon. Yeah, it didn't do anything. Oh, well. Okay. So I'm, ba <laughs> I'm, so, so I'm back in the, uh, the the clock shop. I have two, but I have two. La, 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 I have two. So you went there when it was closed, right? Yes. While it's closed, and I have two books on the table. I haven't clicked either one yet. One says gemstones. One says horology. H o r o l o g y. Okay. So I am looking at a clock. Is that what you're looking at as well? No. I have the same thing as before. I have a lantern on the table. And I have a book that says gemstones and a book that says horology. I'm gonna open the book that says gemstones if I can. I did, and it's it's showing me um. Marbles. Yes, I have four marbles on my screen. Um, so it says that, that I can move around. that I can move around as well. On page eighteen, it has the green. It's the only page I can use. Eighteen and nineteen. Uh, I have the malachite is a copper mineral known for its green color and used in pigments. Yeah, I have that. Quartz, quartz is commonly used in the making of clocks due to its ability to channel energy. That's the white one. Okay. Uh, red is the ruby is hard and durable gemstone that could be. Uh, ease friction in mechanical instruments. Uh, the Dalmatian stone conducts energy. And it's less powerful than a quartz, but doesn't wear down so fast. The black one is an onyx. It can be used as a type of insulator to slow down small electric currents. And then the tiger's eye, which is your brown one, yeah. can be used as a conductor due to its layering of quartz crystals. Okay, so what I'm looking at here, I, I have a clock in front of me with a ton of dials that I can move around and gears. The white raven slamming its beak against the clock over and over and over again. And again. I have four, I have four uh, marbles. I have green, I have white, and I have red and brown or slash tiger's eye. Okay. I need to, so, and I can uh, move these around like a pattern of things. And I think I have to put them in some type of order. Or uh, like, there is another there is another book for me to check out. Horology. Let me see if it does anything for us. Okay. Because I can move these around like a grid, and uh, it looks like I can put them in five different slots. I have four, four on the, the top and one on the bottom, so it kind of makes like a diamond shape, and I can put these okay. things in several different slots, and I'm just messing with them right now, see if I can figure anything okay. out. The, the, the book is signed by Amelie Raven, uh, Horology by Charles C. Shar. Um. Okay, I, found, I, found, I think I found your sequence. Okay. I, I, so for accuracy, the tiger's eye should be to the left of the quartz. Hang on, so which, what color is quartz? Is that, that was green? Yeah. Green, you know, white is quartz. Okay, so the tiger eye should be left of the quartz. The malachite cannot be to the far sides or directly next to the ruby. Okay. The ruby must not. The ruby must not be directly next to the tiger's eye. I got this. Then hang on. All right. No. That's uh, not it. So, so yeah, it's. it's through multiple so, studies, Mrs. Star found that the time place would be more precise when using only quartz in the channeling plate. I think the sequence will be more accurate with the additional benefit of, of storing time. So the tiger's eye should be to the left of the quartz. Mm -hmm. The malachite cannot be to the far sides or directly next to the ruby. Shoot. Okay, that's what I did wrong. Okay, so let me... And the ruby cannot be directly next to the tiger's eye. That didn't do anything either. There's still, there's still more pages for me to read. Yeah, so but, but, hang on. So 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 how we have this, the tiger's eye is the brown one. The malachite is green, right? I have to go back to these things, so. Yeah, go back to the Mal other book and tell Mal me what the colors Mal are. Malachite is green. I'm writing this down, so now now that I know it's important. Malachite is green. Quartz is white. Quartz is white. Ruby red. Ruby is red. Honestly. Dalmatian is Dalmatian pattern. I don't have that one. I just have then I have tiger's uh, eye. I on, think. On, onyx onyx is black and tiger's eye is brown, like streaky, like yeah. one of those shooter marbles. Yep, okay. That's what I have. Tiger's eye is brown. Back to, so back to the first book or the other book and now read me the sequence again to how the order should be with okay. those four rubies or those four colors. Okay. The tiger's eye should be to the left of the quartz. So brown, left of white. Okay. Uh, Malak Malachite cannot be to the far side, so it has to be one of the middle pieces. Green has to be middle. One of the two. Ruby, Ruby cannot be next to Tiger's Eye. Ruby, not brown. Okay. Uh, no. And it, does it just show the four points on top, or can I use the bottom one as well? Um, so picture like shows two. Picture shows four. Because it's like I, I see what you, I know what you have. It's it's like one, two, three, four. And then one all, in the middle. All, point, all pointing down to the bottom. Correct. So yeah. Um, 
It's not showing anything for the thing up at the bottom. So all the four, uh, all four have to be up top. Now, but there's more to this now. Okay. For the highest precision point, the balance need uh, point the balance needle towards the third quartz, point the star. Balance needle. Hold on, that's a star. It says point it towards a malachite. Stores time. So point the precision point towards malachite. Once everything is set up for optimal accuracy, wind the clock up by turning the top right gear clockwise twice. Holy crap. Okay, hang on. So <laughs> <laughs> I, I literally just pointed the balance needle to Malachite, which is a green. I think I, okay. I think I have the order correct because I okay, have so, so, so here's okay. my order. I have um Tiger's Eye on the far left. I have Malachite in the one next to that. I have quartz next to that. And I have uh, Ruby next to that because Ruby can't be next to. Well, I can, well maybe maybe it's got to be the other way around. Then maybe it should be because um, Brown. Ruby and Tiger. Ruby and Tiger's eye cannot touch. Right, and I have um, and Green has to be in one of the middle. So I have Tiger's eye on the far left, Ruby on the far right. But it says here that the quartz needs to be, or the Tiger's eye needs to be to the left of the quartz. So I wonder if I have to literally make that directly Tiger's to the eye? left. Tiger's Eye, Quartz, Malachite, Ruby. That's exactly how I have the lineup up top. Yep. So Tiger's Eye should be the left of Quartz. Malachite cannot be the far side directly next to Ruby. So I literally just set it up as Tiger's Eye, Quartz, Malachite, Ruby. Brown, okay. white, green, red. I think is the right order. And uh, then I, uh, I, po I point, point the balancing point needle at green, which I just did. Okay. When everything is when everything is set for optimal accuracy, wind the clock up by turning the top right gear clockwise twice. Top right what? gear clockwise twice. Once the lid has closed, test the experiment by setting the clock to 12. This should initiate the extraction process. Okay, it actually didn't uh, do anything by turning it clockwise twice. And then so close maybe the lid. I can't close the lid. I'm assuming the lid's going to close automatically if I get this right. So yeah, that didn't do anything. So maybe I don't have the order right, or maybe I need to totally restart. Let me go back in. How about Ruby? Uh, it looks like the clock stayed identical to the way I had it before. How about Ruby, Malachite, uh, Quartz, Tiger's Eye? Let me try it. Like backwards. Does that, will, will, I still have, will I still have the Tiger's Eye to the left of the Quartz? Ruby, Malachite, Ruby, oh, Malachite, yeah, ta Tiger's, Tiger's Eye, Eye quartz. quartz. Yeah, that still has it as that. Okay, so now so, let's try, so try that. And then you just said the top right gear oh, clockwise. Okay, 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 okay. That can't be right. The Malachite cannot be next to the Ruby. Correct. You're right. You're right. You're right. Um, so Ma we got to move Malachite, this now. Malachite, uh, so Malachite cannot be on the, on the far sides either. So. Malachite can't be on the far side. So Malachite has to be... So, 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 Where, so let's start with Ruby. One of the two middles. Yeah, so Ruby it cannot be next to Brown. And since Ruby can't be next can't to Brown be, can't and okay, Malachite can't be on the ends, Ruby cannot be the far left. Now, okay. if we put Ruby in the first middle one, again, it can't be next to Malachite, so that rules that out. Now, if we move Ruby to, say, the third one malachite then goes on the end and again that rules that out so ruby has to be far right ruby has to be far right okay um malachite the only way this works is the way we had it the way we had it so brown white green red it's the only way it works because if ruby can't be on the end I'm can't sorry, do if Malik we can't we can't do green red. Ruby Malachi cannot be next to brown, you said. Ruby can Ruby cannot be next to Cal uh to, to Malachite. I thought you said Ruby cannot be next to Tiger's Eye. Are you sure Ruby, you're reading Ruby it right? Can't, Ruby can't be next to either of them. Ruby has to touch quartz. Ruby has to touch quartz. Okay, so I don't have it right. Um Ruby has to touch quartz. It doesn't it does not matter you know. Malachite can touch quartz because Tiger's Eye will still be to the left if it goes first. Okay, so what, should we try brown, green, white, red? Yes. And then point, uh, the balancing needle points towards green. Malachite. So right in the center, in the left center. And then we spin the top gear clockwise twice, right? 
Yes. That worked. That worked. That worked. Okay, now I right. set the clock to 12. Yeah, so the lid closed. Now I set the clock to 12. And it's doing something. It's transporting me somewhere. The raven just disappeared into the clock. Oh. And now the raven disappeared into the clock. The time is going back and forth between it just did. Uh, I think it's doing what yours did before. Oh my God! Does your did yours not stop? So, <laughs> nope. Okay, so it's doing what yours did before. <laughs> so I see. Hang on, I'm just gonna start when it spins again. Damn, that's confusing. Yeah, I told you. Twelve fifteen. Twelve fifteen. Twelve fifteen. Twelve thirty. Twelve fifteen. Twelve thirty. Twelve thirty. Twelve fifteen. Spin around back to twelve fifteen. All right, let me write this down now. I wonder if I have to. No, there's no way I can. Okay, right, this is gonna be confusing as hell. Because <laughs> I feel it has something to do with the actual like spinning of the level. But we can't stop on. Um, Every... we can't stop on twelve thirty. Unless I guess twelve thirty would tend to be looking at like the instrument shop. I guess. You know what I mean. Okay, so. But here's here's the issue though. How do we go? So if it's like when it's twelve fifteen, twelve fifteen, we're it's we're not going like we can't make it so that we are constantly getting back to it. So I don't know if it, it has to do with spinning the level, but we'll run with the theory. What's yours? Twelve, twelve fifteen, twelve, 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 twelve fifteen, twelve thirty. Two times around clockwise. So spin. Landing on 12. Spin twice clockwise. It's 12. Landing on 12. 12, 15, 12, 12. 12, 12? Yeah. It's impossible. We can't stop it at 12. So it doesn't have to do with spinning the levels. I'm going to back out. Well, that was in the basement of the house for me. I'm checking out the. Uh, Oh, I can still move the train track. Little train thing. Yeah, that didn't do anything. I tried to I tried to redo the pattern for the train. <laughs> uh, while you go in the basement, I'm gonna try your theory of spinning. But yeah, I can't stop on anything other than these four points. So 12, 12, 15, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 15, 12, 30, spin twice clockwise back to 12, the one, two, 12, 15, and it's impossible to go to 12 12. See, I can't do yours, but I can technically do mine. Let me try my own. See what happens here. All right, so I'm on 12 15 is my starting point. So 12 15. 12 15. Oh, crap, I screwed it up. Back to that. So 12 15. I'm trying to make it like the, the actual clocked it because I get bounced a little bit, so I'm trying to make it bounce. 12, 15. 12, 15. 12, 15. 12, 30. 12, 15. 12, 30. 12, 30. 12, 15. Spin twice. Clockwise. Back to 12, 15. That did not do anything for me. Eventually. What if... I'm at, I, I'm confused. I have no idea. 12 is up. 12, 12, 12 is 15. up. 12, 15 is right. 12, up, 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 right. 12, 30 is down. Oh, you're and trying the train. Down. It went to 12. No. 
Now you have 12, 15, 12, 15, 12, 15. I have 12, 30. 12, 30, 12, 15 on the right. Clock spun twice. Then I have 12, 15, 12. Anything? No. <laughs> uh, you got to be onto something, though. Maybe that's it. I feel. Like, I feel like. I feel like the spin is where our two connect. So I'm Ooh. just trying to. Find, I'm just trying to. Okay. I'm just trying to, chop, I'm just trying to chop out the spins. Okay. So obviously mine has to go first, or at least portion. Of, so. Not necessarily so because my twelve twelve fifteen is uh, for me uh, three so, times so, to the so, right. So, so not so necessarily. Sorry, twelve fifteen up once. That's right. I'm trying to answer. Right. Up, up, up. Right. Up, up. Right. Down. Right, right, right. Down. Right. Not it. Okay. Not it. Uh, all right, let me try it then. Let me see if I can figure it out. So, right, right, right. Oh, no, because I can't go down, so... Mine cannot start. Yours has to start. It's, it's just, I think it's just knowing where in my sequence mine starts. Up. Right. So up. Let's start. Up, so up, up. So up, up, right, up. Down. Right. Down. And then pick up at yours. Right, of right, 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 right. Down. Down. Right. Down. Right. Down. Right. That's it! Holy shit, dude! It didn't work for me. I mean, I screwed up then. So okay, so, up, so so you're gonna go up, right, up, 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 right, down, right, 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 down, right, down, right, uh, down, right. You should be finishing in the bottom right-hand corner. Yeah, you, you could, could, you, could you mess up there? You messed me up. Okay, um, so, up. So, Right. Right. Up, up, up. Up, up, up. Right. Right. Down. Down. Right, right, right. Right, right, right. Down. Down, right. Down, down, right. Down, down. So the spin, the spin was our connect. All right. The so spin was the this. connect. So it was your first section, the spin, and then my next section. That's cool. Okay. Trains here or something? I uh, didn't even look out. Uh, yes, it is. Moving on. Yeah, guys, we're smart. <laughs> we figured it out. Chapter three. It was easier than I thought to extract time from animals. Now I had to learn how to do the same with people. I knew Lyric wouldn't want to harm the people who went into the clock, so I decided to give them a way out. A way out, which we also played in our playthrough is on our YouTube channel. Uh, look it up. <laughs> we are now 1937. 1937. Put that down. Dude, how... Props on figuring out the the thing. I would have. I probably wouldn't have thought of that. I had to see what was this. What was the same for us? So the spin was the same for us. Oh boy. Ooh, so bubble. now we. <laughs> no, <laughs> you have to spin snakes. So now we're in front of a, a a giant clock. It looks like maybe or some gears. I have three hanging lights in front of me in front of that house. I have um, six hanging lights. Oh, that, left, dude. So right. that's where that's where the train track used to be. You can see right there. Attention, close track. So the the platform is no longer there now so where i am i'm in front of a, a large gate yeah mm -hmm. which was where the train used to be uh the gate has uh two three four so 12 on each side of those little yeah. things yeah mm -hmm. i got that as well well uh it should be 24. okay so three three lights hanging to my left three lights hanging to my right right and uh i can turn them and interacting with those does turn some of the lights on on the gate yep i turned them all on uh, I did not. And I just turned them off. Okay. Yeah, I left them off for now because we can't get through that gate. So I think we do have to find maybe three, maybe other oh, lights. There's more, there's more lights as you said. So I'm going to turn these lights on for now. Oh, yeah. Let's turn them all on. See what happens. So there's the house. I like the tunes are playing. Check out, a, check out BG Maintenance, our video game music podcast every Wednesday if you like hearing these tunes. Maybe, a, maybe we'll play a track. <laughs> we'll, play, we'll play the clicking of the clicking of the light bulbs track. Uh, uh, I turn them all on. Uh, They're all I, on my side. I, should we click on the open. gate or should we? Uh, did, did it not open the gate? You tried. I, did, I tried. Okay, so it does not open the gate. So that means there's a definite set order 
that we have to turn these on to get the gate open. So now let's start exploring. Uh, okay, Raven, uh, Raven I, I just clicked on Raven's clock by accident and I'm heading in there. So let's start there. <laughs> uh, it is a dark room. I can't see a damn thing. It's a dark room. I can't see a damn thing. But, okay, but I, I, can, go, I can go in the basement. Yep. Uh, I have a lantern oh boy, down oh here. Uh, it looks like a wire that's cut. Oh my God. A giant puzzle. Okay. Yeah, this is like this is like a bomb. Yeah, so it's um, definitely a bomb. Um, I have I have two, I have nine different symbols and my thing is turned off. I have nine different symbols and mine is also turned off. I have ladder, uh, doll, raven, for my top three, and then my middle row is gear, keyhole, fox. My bottom row is snake, hourglass, butterfly, or moth. Are they move? Are they movable? Uh. I can click them, but I can't move them. Because mine go is different. I have the same symbols, just in different spots. Yeah, I can't. I can't move them, but I can click them. Okay, so I'm gonna turn my thing on. Uh, as will I. Okay, mine are moving now that I turned it on. It's showing the video. Yeah. Did yours? I, I I think I know what we're supposed to do here. We gotta turn our things on at the same time. And then I see a symbol on mine. We click that symbol. You see a symbol on yours. You click that. We click that symbol. I think it's how we do. Did you see a symbol when you turned yours on? No. Okay, so that's what we got to do. Ready? Click. Uh, turn it on now. Three, two, one. I have three dots. I have no Raven. Have a click Raven. Click Raven. Snake. It says three. All it says is three. three dots. No, it just three says dots? it just said three. The number three. Maybe we're supposed to click the third one at that point on our list. I'm gonna try it. Hang on. My, my, my thing stopped. No, I, I, I turned mine back on. So it should be it's Raven, Snake. Now it says two. Okay, that works. So it was the second one in the list. Uh, I'm gonna turn mine back off and we'll get going. So you ready? Okay. Three, two, one, go. So Raven, Snake. Raven, Open. Snake is the is the first order. So we have Raven. Snake. And now it says one. So click butterfly. Five. Keyhole. What's that? Uh, keyhole. Keyhole. Fox minus two. Fox minus two would be hourglass. Uh, bottom left two. Keyhole. Uh, nope, that's snake? wrong. Damn it. Damn it. Was it bottom was, left was, plus two or minus two? It was, it was bottom left and arrow pointing. It was a crap. Okay. Bottom left. Okay. So it two with an arrow pointing to the bottom left. Yeah. Maybe that means two times the one that was in the bottom left. That could have been. All right, I'm turning it on. Uh, Raven, snake, uh, butterfly. Hourglass. Hourglass. Nope, that was wrong. Nope. It was keyhole. Okay. <laughs> uh, three, two, one, on. Raven, snake. Uh, butterfly. butterfly. Always butterfly. Mm -hmm. What is it? Hourglass. Nope. Seven to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. It was a uh, ship ship wheel. Okay, that's that was two for me. Um, why do you keep oh, saying that? Why do you keep saying why do you keep saying hourglass? Mine because mine mine turned off. Yeah. I you have to give me enough time or else it, it uh, expires. Okay. So uh, let's go. Three, two, so one. Oh. oh. Okay, go. It's always Raven, Snake, Butterfly, it seems like, but just double check. It's uh, always the so same thing. Raven, Raven snake, snake, Butterfly. butterfly. Keyhole. Snake hourglass. Plus, snake plus three is Hourglass. Now uh, what? Ship wheel. Railway. So the tracks. Keyhole plus, keyhole plus two. It's hourglass. Nope. Damn it. Uh, is it Keyhole plus two? Keyhole plus two is Hourglass, and that wasn't right. You sure? Yeah. Hmm. I'll do it again. Raven. Snake. Raven, snake, butterfly. Butterfly. Keyhole. Fox plus two hourglass. is hourglass. Ship wheel. Ladder. Puppet. Uh, butterfly. Last and one. This is top five. It says five hour top right. So snake. Snake. When, whatever you're saying there is confusing me because I'm not getting it when you say five arrow top right. That makes no sense to me because I don't have when anything I, that ever I, looks like that. When I say that, I have to tell you what I have. So it was. No, I know, but that doesn't make any sense to me. 
So let's write this out again so we can speed through that port. Raven. It's gonna go, it's gonna go Raven. Yep. Snake. Snake. Butterfly. Right. Uh, keyhole. Hourglass. Uh, keyhole. Hourglass. Ship wheel. Ladder. Puppet. Puppet. That's all I remember. And then, and then and once we get to that, we'll figure it out. Here right. we go. <laughs> Turning on now. Yes. So, Raven. Raven. Snake. snake butterfly. butterfly keyhole, keyhole. Ship wheel. Uh, it wasn't ship wheel. No, it was um, hourglass. Hourglass. Uh, that's ship what I wheel. Ladder. Puppet. Now it says bug. Butterfly. Butterfly. Yep. Um, so butterflies after puppet. Snake. And then mine, mine just turned off. Our, I keep screwing this up. Hold on. I have to get back to my spot to help you out. I'm sorry. No worries. No worries. No worries. Raven, snake, butterfly, keyhole, hourglass, <laughs> ship, ladder, puppet. Is it raven? Butterfly. Butterfly. Four is snake. Snake's snake. howl is wolf. So wolf. Wolf. Minus three wolf is raven. Uh, snake. Snake. This is five, one, two, three, four. keyhole. Uh, ship wheel. Shh. Down one, snake. Feather. Uh, raven, I guess? Yeah. Raven, escape. Keyhole. Ladder. Of course it was a keyhole. God damn it, Frank. <laughs> Keep calling it a ladder. It's a railroad track. <laughs> It's not a railroad track. Yes, it is, because it says it said railway on mine once, and that's what, what, it, what, what oh, it was. Son of a bitch. Keyhole. Okay. Yeah! <laughs> I, have, I, have a, I have a compass rose. Yeah, me too. Uh, pointing uh, northeast, inner, northeast, uh, between, north, northeast. Mm. Northeast, twice. So yours is northeast twice? Yeah, yeah so my, my inner gear is northeast, my outer gear is also northeast. Okay, so inner ear. My, 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 both of my X's are uh, on the outer wheel, and they're uh, south and southeast. South and southeast. Okay. That is probably more harder than it should have been. <laughs> so your two were northeast, one on the inner, one on the outer. And mine yes. were south and southeast, ooh, ooh, ooh. both on the I outer. Scroll, I, I scrolled back up, and I was, uh, um... Uh, Ooh, what do they call a, a, that? a radio. A, one of them there. One oh of them there. Radios. <laughs> I left my machine on in case it. Uh, in case I don't know why I did, but I left it on. Let's see if there's senses like there were before. Ooh, my, my, I start the sentence this time. Yes, you do. Three patients from the nursing home in Hillebake have vanished in the middle of the night. The talented Amelie Raven has returned from Switzerland. She is determined to reopen and bring back glory to Raven's clocks. The, po uh, the police are looking for anyone who was in the vicinity of the nursing home yesterday evening. They are asking for assistance finding the missing patients. The post office's water damage is repaired and all the post boxes are ready. To be used again, there is already a letter in post box 34. Hang on, 34. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the tragic nursing home incident has reopened old wounds in the old village. We hope that these disappearances won't remain unsolved like those five years ago. We have no new news when train service will return to our village again. The station is now permanently closed. Oh, this is on the land right there. <laughs> uh, Clarissa Shar, the generous benefactor of our new clock tower, died last month. At the opening ceremony next week, we will honor her memory. All right. So the only thing I picked out of that was post box office number 34. That's all I got out of that, too. Then we might need that again. Or Damn, did any of that make any sense for the light bulbs either? I don't think so. Hmm. Uh, post box then? Should we try it out? Yeah. All right. I, I have post box 34. Okay, I have a, a, a speaker. 
with a light and something that looks like, you know, I could tap out Morse code with. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> I, I have just all even number post office boxes. Box number 16 is open, but nothing in it. Okay. Oops. Uh, so I'm going to open 34, I'm assuming. Yeah. I clicked it once, nothing happened. Uh, oh, you're going to need to, does it have the thing where you can set the compass rows? Yes. You're going to need our points. So northeast, northeast, south, southeast. Northeast, northeast, south and southeast. Yep. One of your northeast was on the at outer ring. Both of mine okay, were I, on the outer ring. It. Okay. I got it to open. Did you, do you have a, uh, hopefully a Morse code thing there? <laughs> it says post office telegram. If you okay. post office telegram. Post Tell office telegram. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It feels like I was gone for such a long time, but for all the time I was away, it still felt short. Too short to finish my invention. Now we will have the longest lives ever, longer than you could imagine. When you repeated this message, I'll guide your way. I have no that idea is what that happened there. I have no idea what that means. Um, I literally can tap this thing, and it I can tap it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten times. Um. Yeah, it's, I can move the, the compass wheels on every single one of these things. Yeah, I, I could too when I when I had the things on mine and I couldn't open any of the other ones. Nope. How do I, how do I, I don't, maybe there's something else we gotta do first, cause. Maybe. Yeah, cause I can't interact with any, like I can only interact with this like typing a telegram. Um. I'm gonna, should we check out the other house? <laughs> Ooh, I have a telephone, but it's missing. It doesn't have a lot of numbers on it. Are you in the house? Yeah. Oh, let me go to the house. You said, you said, you said the other house. Oh, I didn't know if you had anyone there or not. Oh, okay. So, yeah, I'm in a, also a, a, a booth with a phone, an old style phone. With, I have uh, the numbers 567 plus 8, to, uh, the tilde sign and 9. I have 1, 2, 3, pound 4, star 0. <laughs> I have the ones you don't. Hmm. Okay. Oh, pushing the numbers is uh, bringing out sentences. Five. No, I'm an idiot. Six, seven. I can only push five numbers, though. How about I go? I undo that. Um. I have all. I have five sentences opened up right now. Does star bring up a sentence? It does. Yeah. Uh, I guess we read them in order to each other? No. I feel like we each need a sequence of five numbers. One, two, three, four, okay, zero. Okay, so, 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 so you, you can reset it by hitting the, uh, the phone. Yeah, I figured that out too just now. <laughs> Wait, Where have we gotten the sequence from, though? I have no idea. I'm just clicking buttons and trying to make a make a make sense of the actual um, the numbers were given. Only one of mine has a capital letter at the start. And that is. What number is that? That's the number two. Number two is the only one that has a capital letter for me at the start. Uh, nothing. Nothing has a, has a capital letter for me. Weird. Did you even try so, the symbols? So, so. Yeah, so what's two say? Two says, hey, Lyric, I'm so glad you finally. <laughs> oh, it says. Okay, so it's going to be two seven. Um, so I'm going to write my, so seven will be my first one. Oh, does yours, does yours finish that? Well, because seven will finish that sentence. It will? Uh, deci decided to pick up the phone. I've been leaving. Hang on, so two for me, seven for you. So it says, so what's it say? What's that? What's seven say? Decided to pick up the phone. I've been leaving. Let me find the next sequence then. That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. Okay, there it is. It's uh, star. Star is my next number. So let me redo this. So two star. Um. So after year seven, it says you so many messages. Wait, I know you're still. Um, then it's gonna be five on my end. Angry, but 
don't want you to hang up on me yet. I really want you to. It's uh, four. Four is my next one. So two star four. And four says, know that before I left, I made you something to keep. Um, shit. Uh, eight. Okay. It's going to be, it's going to, it's upstairs. No, that's not it. And it's even, no, hold on. No. Reset. Hold on, second. Oh, oh, I didn't mean to hit that. That's a minus seven, five. And what does five say again? Angry, but don't want you to hang off me yet. I really want you to. Know that before I left, I made you something to keep. So. Any of the other symbols so I can just get through that. Let's keep. Is it keep like dot dot dot? No, it's just keep. Let's. Let me try six. No. Unless I have the continuation. No, because I would. Well, it's possibly. Okay, nine. Keep you company. Okay, nine. Uh, I would have told you. That's it? To keep you company, I would have told you? I keep you company, comma. I would have told you. Uh, I remember one of mine started with earlier. Let me find it. Hang on. Two, pound, four, three. Yeah, earlier, but you dot, 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 never mind. Are you still? Uh, six on my end. So mad at me. No, because no. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Oh, 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 yeah. Okay. Not any of those? So seven five. Ah, uh, boy. <laughs> seven five. Yours is seven five nine so far. Uh, then it's gonna be the tittle sum for me. Um, the tilde there. Yeah, there, question mark. You know your ra you know your raven that went missing, the one. Um, trying to find my next one. I only got three letters left, so. The one. Okay, so it's got to be this one then. Hang on. Mine. You named well, Cole. I found, I, uh, mine is last one is zero. It says the one you named Cole. I made a new one for you. It's upstairs and it's even better. This one cannot die. What's the mine, last one was eight. eight. Mine was eight. So two star four three zero is mine. And yours is seven eight, five nine till day eight. Can I hit the phone? Perfect. It's ringing. Good job. And we're going upstairs. There you go. Yep. There you go. Okay. I have a. Mechanical bird. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> I have schematics for said mechanical bird. <laughs> my, my mechanical bird is in is in a cage and it has the letter Z Z Z that I can re I can go through the entire freaking alphabet. So these three letters. I have the uh I have the schematics for that mechanical bird. <laughs> Do you have a password for that mechanical bird? Um I have no idea. It could be three letters. It could be more than three letters if it's like the AE sign together because that's a letter as well. Well, OK, so here we go. I'll start with this one here. It looks like it's the schematics for its wing has a gear in the middle, a little knob it says figure nine. Um, Maybe maybe four C is what it looks like. I have no idea. It, it looks like I don't think that would be used for anything because it's very hard to read. It's like just scratched on there. But 4C, if it means anything to you, it looks like that's what it is for me. 4C, uh, that's, that's, all, that's, all, that's all you have there? That's all that's on that schematic. Now there's another schematic with two gears on it, uh, showing which way they move, and that's it. There's another schematic that looks like it says, on the, on the one on the left, it says 6 with a 4 underneath it. On the one on the bottom, it shows an X for like the X and Y grid with two arrows pointing up and two arrows, one arrow pointing to the left, one arrow pointing to the right. And then there's something on the right hand side. And I don't know what these things are. They look like they would just be like the inside of a bird, I guess. Um, it says till day 32.4 with a seven with arrows pointing left and right and a two with arrows pointing up and down. Hmm. Then there's uh, the schematics for the beak and the like the neck. 
uh, with a, oh, these are diameters is what this is. So like it shows an inch diameter and then X would be a di, I guess a diameter and then C and then another X is a diameter. And then, yeah, that's what this is here. Uh, is the there anything else there? Cause that's not helping me at all. Uh, well, the only thing that's interesting to me is that I, I see something that looks like the, uh, the telegram thing. Um, that I, that I have in the, in the post box, but it's not showing me what I should be doing here. Because this thing is locked and I have three, I have three letters that Which, it can be like that. Yeah. And, uh, unless it's, uh, unless it's a C and X and, a uh, well, there's like one other letter I saw in here. What was it? B. <laughs> Those are the only C three letters I'm yeah. seeing. Yeah. Those are the only letters on my schematic, C, X, and B. And then I, like I said, I have a, uh, a diagram that has a, a circle with on the left side of the circle, it's cut in half up, you know, north. it's, it's cut in half. If you draw a line right down the middle from north to south on the left hand side is the thing that you would tap for the telegram on the right hand side is the head of the bird. And then, uh, it's, it's like a clock and it goes from 12, three, six, nine with through six points in between all of those. So kind of like the gate outside, but they're all lit up or like they're all shaded in. So that doesn't help. <laughs> <sighs> Nothing with letters. Uh, C, X and B, but I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to tell you what order they go in because it's all just on these random schematics that aren't numbered no, 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 by which, any stretch Which, which of one came first? C came first, though? Uh, there, there's no first. I just, that's the one I clicked on first. They're not in any order. They're just up on a wall. There's also an, uh, no, that's a four. No, I was gonna say there's also an A, but that's a four. Um... XBC X. didn't work. How about XCB? Unless we go by maybe the body of a bird, like so, maybe B is first. Okay, so f for the back, for, for the, the beak of my bird is so this is the far right. His wings are to the middle. His tail is to the left. Far right. Try C. Okay, C to the far right for a beak. Tail would be maybe that, that's also C. It looks like can you use the same letter twice. Yes. That's that's because there's a C on the one for the tail. There's a C on the one for the beak and then you have one for the body. Yeah, that would be B B. No, no, that's that's the schematic I have. <laughs> Unless We're it's, unless it's yeah. X, try C, X, C. Try that. The X, C? Try that. No. Nothing. Damn. I feel like I feel like these schematics don't have the letters that you need. Do, are, there, are there literally A through Z? Is you literally? And then some. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> there's, also, there's, there's letter A, there's letter A with a circle over it. There's the letter... Uh, the, the number zero, like like oh, with a like a thing through it. It's also the AE letter. Okay, yeah, the, the schematic. I I feel like I don't have the right information for you yet. I don't know, man. Like, yeah, what, what do you, what do you have? You have head. Like, what is the schematic for what parts of the body? So it's it's like a beak, and then it's connected to just like a gear with like okay. a, a hammer shaft on it, so to speak. Okay, and what letter is that? Uh, X C X. All three letters are on that. In no particular order. <laughs> like X is showing a diameter for like the head. C is showing the diameter for I guess it would be like the throat. And X again is showing the diameter for what would be like underneath that, like your your neck. And there's, oh, al there's also another X on that plus the letter B. <laughs> so there's five letters on that one schematic. Is there schematic for the, for the like the like for where the uh, the Wang would be? Uh, there's not. No. I don't have that. Nope. 
Uh, oh, 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 wag is a technical term. I understand. I don't have that. <laughs> I know you. I know you'll have one. Oh <laughs> snap! Yeah, I actually don't have a schematic for that. Is what I was trying Thanks, to say. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No. Um. Yes. Yeah, so the the bird is laying here dead. A lot dead with robotic. Yeah, um, it, it's definitely a mechanical bird. In a cage. Yep. Uh, with his tail to your to my far left, his beak to my right, and he's you know just laying across. Ugh. Yeah, yeah. Do you think we have to leave this? Do you think we maybe have to come back to that? Or I think we may need more information on that one. But then I I don't know what to do with my uh the Morse code thing that I have either <laughs> on my on my, in the post office. Hmm. Because it's not like I can tap it to the numbers we used on the phone, so I can't like tap it two times and then four times, and you know what I mean. I can't do that. The schematic here is is nothing. Like th this one doesn't help me. The one that has a picture of the actual uh, tapping thing on it. I don't even know what the hell that technical term of that thing is. Um, only thing is like this this head of this bird. In this thing it really is weird I don't know I feel like the I actually don't know what I feel like I don't know I'm confused at this point I was confused um I left the house for are... a minute would you okay so I'll leave the house I just wanted to just glance around and see if I could figure anything else out I went back in the clock shop to see if there was something I missed in terms of like the Morse code. I don't, think, I just don't see anything else in here. Shh, shh, shh. Peace out. Um, were you hitting something to make the Morse code sound? No. I was hearing clicking before. I like, thought that was Morse code. I guess not, okay. Are you sure it wasn't just a clock? It could be the clock. It could be the clicking of your mouse, though. Oh, maybe. Yep, there you go. Yeah, I am. I am, I am, I am using my mouse. <laughs> and it's not I the. Uh... I overthought that one. Oh, that's funny. I turned this machine off, and it's making me do the sequence again. But that's fine. Cause we already know what it was. Uh, okay, so. Raven Raven's clock shop has nothing else for me. Um, I'm gonna go back in this post office. Yeah, like what? I don't understand. One eternity later. By sheer coincidence. Hey, Lyric, I'm so glad you finally used so many messages. Sorry. Wait, I know you're still. Know that before I left, I made you something to keep earlier, but you, never mind, are you still? You named Cole. Cole! Spell it. K O L. You're an asshole. I hate you. Is that it? I'm doing it right now. Okay. Brian, I swear to God, if that's it, I'm going to punch you in the throat. I yeah, I'm I'm willing to bet it's it at this point. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> so Cole from the sentence works. I can interact with the bird now. My god, we are fucking dumb. Ooh. I clicked his head. His eye lights up and he goes, uh. <laughs> okay. Tell me it gives something for the Morse code, or tell me it, it does something for uh the light bulbs outside or uh -huh. he's giving me he's giving me more scope <laughs> we're getting somewhere <laughs> well, we're gonna Jesus we're gonna the Christ we're going to start from the beginning I'm going to start writing this down okay? that's fine with me holy crap yeah, he, he might actually finish this game he does he does cause he, his eye lights up at certain times and sometimes the cause are short sometimes they're long like a, like a thing so one. So claw long. Dot dash. Dot dash. Guy goes too fast, fast. Fast, fast? <laughs> I 
Here we try this again, so. Dot, dash, dot, dash, 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 dot, dot, dash, 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 dot. That's the whole sequence. Okay. Oh, you wrote that down. I didn't. Um, you mother. I thought I you were. I thought you were writing it down. Okay. I was. I was. I was okay. We'll do it again. I was paying <laughs> full attention to this. All right. right? Yeah. You, 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 you right. I'm ready to go. Okay. Dot dash. Dot dash. <laughs> dash. <laughs> dash. Dot dot dash. <laughs> Why dash. are you saying it like that? Like that. Dash. <laughs> dot. Because I did exactly how you did it. Damn. <laughs> okay. That's 12 um, things. So I'm going to repeat this back to you. Watch it as it goes. Dot, dash, dot, dash, 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 dot, dot, dash, 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 dot. Yes. That's 12. And I can put this, push this thing five to ten times. Dot, dash, dot, dash, dash, dash. Dot, dot, dash, 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 dot. That didn't do anything. Work? No. Okay. I can, I, like I said, if there's 10 instances I can click this thing. Those are 12 things. Maybe that 12 are, are, are the sequence of the lights on my side. So it'll be. What lights? Light. The lights you light up, so. Why uh, would it be? Remember, oh, your side. Because my side is the, is the raven side, so I have light, no light, light, no, 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 light, light, no, 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 light. No, other oh, way around, sorry. No light, light. So that's so all the dashes that I gave you would be are lights. Light. So let me go down there and do that. How does that help me? It doesn't. <laughs> you gotta figure out your shit. Incorrect. You have to help me because we need the lights on my side. Is Raven si Raven side was the right side, right? Yeah. So starting here, all the dashes are lights or all the dots are lights? All the dashes are lights. Dash, dot, dash, 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 dot, dot, dash, 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 dot. Okay. So I have the lights for your side. So it should be off, on, off, on, 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 off, off, on, 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 off, right? So off, on, off? I have uh, off, on, off. You said the dashes were, were okay, on. So, so off, on, off, on, on, on. Off, off, off on, off, on, on, off. On, on, off, or less. Correct. Okay. Okay, so now we gotta figure out your side. So we, we're halfway there. Right. Whoa, well, living on a prayer. Um, does my bird have anything else to do for you? I don't think so. I think the Morse code thing is gonna be how you're gonna give me the other half of the things. Absolutely. How can, solve, how can I solve that for you? Is the question. You have to be able to help me solve it because I helped you solve. Yeah. Well, coal was the answer to, to the thing, so which, that came from Which that. I had, yes, which I had, and that came from the the phone the phone booth. The only other thing I have that you don't is that telegram, so that telegram is something. Yeah, well, yeah, that much we know. And I tried inputting it letter by letter and it didn't do anything, remember? Yeah. Feels like I was gone for such a long time, but for all the time I was away, it still felt short, too short to finish my invention. Now we will have the longest lines ever. That's a chunk of your life. Wait, read that again. It feels like I was gone for such a long time. But for all the time I was away, it still felt short. Too short to finish my invention. Now we will have the longest lives ever, longer than you could imagine. When you repeated this message, I'll guide your way. There's a hidden message in that. You, see, you figured it out? I think so. What's the hidden message? 
the words long and short. Okay. I think you have to tell. So read that to me. I think I have to go long is dash, right? Okay. Short is dot. Repeat the message long? and I'll guide your way. So I have to enter it twice. Okay. What is it? Okay. Okay, so long time, long time. I, it's a read, read, it to, read it to me and I'll pick it out. It feels like I was gone for such a long time. Long. But for all the time I was away, it felt short. Short. Too short. Short. Probably twice. No, I'm going to stick with once okay. for now. Now you'll have the longest lives ever. Okay. Long. Longer long. than you can imagine. Long. When you repeat this message, I'll guide your way. That's it. That's fucking it. Long, short, short, long, long. So dash, dot, dot, dash, dash, repeated, dash, dot, dot, dash, dash. My it, man. It turned on the speaker, and now the light bulb is turning off and on over and over and over again. So you should have figured out the sequence. Oh, man. Val Robin. <laughs> uh, okay, so how do I restart the sequence? I totally missed it because I was so should, excited. Should, wait, 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 wait. If it doesn't go through, it'll stop for a second, then we'll take it from the top. No, I have to... I, Push the button. Yeah. Off, on, off. Oh man. Okay, I'm gonna have to really write this down. It literally took you reading that like a hundred times for me to pick up on the long and the shorts in the in the actual telegram. Longs and shorts. That's pretty cool. This is only chapter three. She doesn't get harder. Right? <laughs> I think the game's over after chapter three. This has gotta be the pinnacle, dude. It's the last guy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. It's definitely doing something twelve times. I want to make sure I have the sequence right, and then we'll then we'll progress. So off, on, off, 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 on, 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 off, on, on, off. Yeah, I have the sequence right. Let's go ahead okay, and put so this in. So how do you think how do you think we're gonna start from from I think we're gonna literally start it from the end of yours. Okay. So we have on on off was the end of yours. So we're gonna start with the very next one. So we're gonna go off on off. So oh, where, where are we starting from? The end of yours. So again, you're you should be looking at the post office now. And your two left lights should be lit up and then their one on the right yes. should not. So you're gonna start okay. on the next three. So it should be okay. off, on, off for those three. Off, on, off. Okay. Now look at the Robin's clock. Off, uh, off, off, on. Okay. On, on, off. Yeah. On, on, off. That opened the gate. Ryan, we are super geniuses and we're cool. <sighs> I really feel like we are super geniuses at this point. And we're cool. Okay, we're, we're through the clock. We're definitely Let's... cool. We're definitely the cool. We are okay, so have, the epitome of cool. I spit so in the I face. I have a lantern on the ground. Yep. Three planks of wood. Yep. With, with plants. Yep. And a ladder. Yep. That I just dropped. Yep. Me too. And some what words come out. Some words came out. Yeah. What does yours say? My last memory of Lark was a suspicious frown on her face. All those years in Switzerland made it possible for me to finally finish the clockwork. Ooh, another ladder. Let me go up. Is this the end of the game? Uh, no. What's your say? At first, she didn't want the clock. She said she was tired of my presence. I double checked Larrick's clock. It ran exactly as it should. Another ladder. And three boxes in my room, but they'll do, they'll do anything. As, as is mine. What's your say? I held it out to her anyway because I needed her to be with me. Mine says, it didn't occur to me that a crack in the clock face would make a difference. Okay, now I have four, four jars. Four jars, on the yeah, me too. With with numbers on them. Right. As do mine. Are they the same? What is yours? 10, 11, 13, 08, 11, 11, 180. Exactly the same. And in, in, in the same order, left to right. 10, 11, 13, 08, 11, 11, and 180. But there is another ladder. And I dropped the ladder, and I got a sentence. Uh, it's I never told her that she 
that the time was stolen, only that the clock would let us be together forever. Mine says, I had spent years collecting time for us, time that would be added to our lives. Maybe it was a oh time. my god. It was a lot more drawers. Uh, left to right should be 128, 329, 490, 408, 198, 273, 195. You got it. All right, drop the ladder. Right. <laughs> I feel like we're at the end of the game. I do. She closed her hand around the clock and I never saw her again. Instead, she disappeared into the clock. I still haven't found her. There are a lot of jars. Oh! In an empty jar. Yeah. Huh? And a, and a clock chime. Uh, 177, 184, 101, 139, 450, 132, 187, 120, 182. Uh, back to back to front, 111, something in the middle, and then 121. We Four, have the same. Yeah, here we go. 444. Jar, jar. It's opening. A light just went in. And 179. 180. What? Mine says 180. Mine says 179. Fuck. You beat I, the game. Such a shame to see all that time go to waste. I didn't have to build a way out. I hope you and your friend appreciate it. Maybe it's 180 is like how many minutes it took us to play this game? You have Three lost hours. 179 minutes of your life. I have lost 180 minutes of my life. Amelie, would have Amelie added, added 179 minutes to hers. Lyric would have added 180 minutes to hers. Wait. That's the end of the game. the game. That's the end of the game. Wow. Took me three hours to beat this game. With a hundred, well, with an hour and a half of that stuck on one puzzle. <laughs> So for those watching our video and if you've stuck with us to the end to see this uh, to see this through, I cut out a lot of the in between because literally Frank and I were just sitting here scratching our heads with no clue what to do. So the video is probably closer to like an hour, an hour and a half. What do you think? I'm underwhelmed. I I thought that, I thought there were some good puzzles. I'm not going to lie. Those are those are pretty good puzzles, but uh, confusing as hell. That, the, the last one. Yes, uh, I, I, I'm not underwhelmed. I am. I want the game to be longer. That's my, that's my thing. Well, well, we go going in. We knew the game was only two to three hours long. We knew that. But like they, they, they leg legitimately said in the press thing that the game is it's a short experience and that the game is only six dollars. So it's it's a very cheap game. Um, And, that, and I think, you know, for for being five, six dollars. The amount of fun we had solving the puzzles I think is worth the money we are I, super smart. I think that the, clearly that last puzzle showed that we are not super smart but I think that the difficulty of the final puzzle like how to figure out how to open that gate was there, there sh I don't want to say there should have been something blatantly obvious because there was almost, you know what I mean? <laughs> like we just mm -hmm. kept missing over it every single time. And that, that is it was in, on my screen. What's what literally stumped us uh, the bird. And, and I didn't even put two and two together that the um, the letters that you were talking about was a, the name of a bird cage. You know what I mean? I didn't know that it was literally on there for like the name of the cage. So that that is my fault for not knowing that for not picking up on that. But eventually I figured it out. I mean, I mean, we both had each other's answers that are right in front of us. Just... Right. Yeah. No, absolutely. But for what this Ooh, is, can... for what this is. Yeah. So apparently there is a save thing. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, what? Oh, what... So you, you, you can read it again. That's all it is. Okay. Thanks for that. What this actually did. I enjoyed it. But I think that. I don't know, man. I, I think that there. It. Because I don't think anybody should be stuck on a puzzle for an hour and a half. And I like to think that you and I are fairly decent at puzzle games. Like, we, you know, we can move through these things pretty quickly. Um, you know, we were here, we were here to a way out. We we burn through the lake ridden. We burn through those puzzle games, even like going as far back as like myths and that kind of stuff. We're, we're pretty quick at solving them. So yeah, that, one, that, that, that one was a head scratcher. Yeah, to, to get stuck like that for for such a, a long amount of time. And it really it wasn't even that long, but still. Uh, 
I, I think that there should have been just something maybe maybe an emphasis on the word coal or maybe just maybe that maybe that separated or something. I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I had fun with you. I actually had a lot of fun with this. I just I, no, I mean, I, no, with the exception of that puzzle, I, I, I would have wanted to be a, just a touch longer, just a little. A little eh. Yeah, it would have been, it would have been nice if maybe there was like five chapters instead of three. Um, you know, maybe three or four extra puzzles on top of it, because it is. I mean, you know, now this is never a game I'd want to play a second time because we know the answers to everything. Even yeah, even even, even flip flop, I still don't know right? Answer, yeah. Like like with we were here and we were here too. Flip flopping, you know, at least gave us a little bit of a different perspective. My favorite, but, my favorite part, my favorite part was the bomb diffusing thing. That was pretty cool. Like we had to like go back and forth really quick. Like, yeah, I actually think that's probably <laughs> that's probably the most fun we had because you know not only did we not know that you know that was a gear, we kept calling it a ship wheel, like we're freaking pirates, yeah. and uh, you keep calling it a ladder instead of a, a railway, even though you know we were riding trains. Um, that yeah, was, well. that was, that was definitely fun. I, I enjoyed that moment and, uh, trying to, um, what was the other moment that I really enjoyed? I have it written down here somewhere. I'm looking at the, uh, my notes that I took for the, um, for the thing. Uh, oh, the, how we figured out the, the second train map where we had to put together my clock yes. with your clock. I actually thought that was pretty smart how we figured that. And actually, you figured it out. But how, how you were able to come to that conclusion, I actually thought that was really fun. And that was a, a very well implemented puzzle. Uh, you know, the the Malachite, the Tiger's Eye, that was also kind of fun as well. So there's definitely some unique puzzles in here and, and puzzles that I think were extremely well done. I think there was one specific puzzle at the end of the game, figuring out the name of the bird to, you know, that knowing, I'm sorry, knowing that we needed the name of the bird to open the cage was a very, very hard puzzle. But looking back on it now, it's so easy. Like, it's literally three letters on the cage, right? Yeah, it would. I mean, it's it's if you would have said it looks like it's the name, I would be like, oh, shit, I know what this is now. <laughs> but we well, didn't know that. Like, you didn't. There was no way for you to know. We yeah, just knew we that we needed a password. Letters. We don't look for a word. You know, yeah, anything. we just know we needed a password of some sort. So uh, besides that, man, every other puzzle was was pretty well implemented. I, I thought that every single everything else was was done well. So I would be ex interested to see what this team, Other Tales Interactive, uh, could possibly do. You know what I mean? I think that, you know, for a second game or something like if they did uh, TikTok too. <laughs> uh, I think that uh, I, I would definitely play it. What about you? Hell yeah, man. I love these kinds of games in general. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, like I said, I, the fact that they time travel, you could probably uh, make, make another one. Yeah. Or DLC. Or just take a you know, life from somebody else. So yeah, well, you have three at, hours the, at, at the end of the game, was I taking life from you or were they taking life from us, the players? Uh, I don't know. That's a good question. If we kick, if we click continue, what what does it do? It just shows us the. It takes us back to the open clock tower. We can just climb up and then we read everything. Oh, yeah. So I don't. I mean, I I, I did that. I'm in here. All those years in Switzerland. Blah 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 blah. I'm just going up to the top. Ran exactly as it should. I just want to kind of look at the end again and see, like, you know, did they take time for uh, from us or were they taking time from each other, so to speak? You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, I had spent years collecting time for us, time that would be added to our lives. Instead, she disappeared into the clock. I still haven't found her. And then we insert our time that we've played into the jar. So it tells you how long you've took. It's still 179, even though I've been sitting on the screen. And it says here... I didn't have to build a way out. I hope you and your friend appreciate it. And you said something about losing time. Yeah. You have lost 175. You have lost 179 minutes of your life. Amelie added 179 minutes to her. So they took time from us. So the story of the game is that the puzzles in here were meant to distract the players for a certain amount of time and the amount of time that we were spent playing is the amount of time that got added to their lives, I think is the narrative oh. of the story. Oh, is that is that the game we're playing here? That's it, ladies. I'm coming for you. <laughs> they have they're like the, the Sanderson sisters, man. They've they've extracted the life essence and they're that's how they stay alive and beautiful and stuff, right? 
exactly. Well, I need to consult my book. And... <laughs> uh, this was fun, man. Uh, check out our, uh, again, we should have a, a text review up on our website, leveldowngames.com sometime today. Whether that's already up, go check if it is, I don't know. Uh, if it's tonight, I'm not sure. If it's tomorrow morning, it could be. Just whenever we have a chance to write this review, it'll be up on our website again, leveldowngames.com. Plus, check out Kyle's stream. Uh, that's twitch.tv slash Bruce underscore deduce. He will be streaming this game with another uh, another guy tonight on Twitch. Actually, he I actually talked to him and he's going to he's planning on doing it Thursday night. So uh, and, and he'll, he'll, he'll have some free games to give out uh, to anybody in that stream. So if you hear this, there you go. Perfect. 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 And yeah, so I will be in the chat for that as well because I feel like they might need helpful hints. <laughs> I will I will wait until they ask if they need help. You know what I mean? Don't don't know how you make them wait three hours like we did. No, because they're streaming it. And I don't I don't, I don't want someone oh, to sit there bored. <laughs> so anyway, I had fun. Thanks for checking out this LDG plays where we took a look at TikTok, a tale for two available now on Steam for five ninety nine. Until next time, keep on gaming. <laughs>